in the former video, we spoke about the history of the industry and I promised to give you some crazy numbers which will blow your mind. All numbers you will see now are published in the annual reports for 2019 of the World Federation of Direct Sales Association, or short, WFDSA. Local direct sales organizations are responsible to regulate their industry in their respective countries and report their numbers yearly to the WFDSA. You will find the referring documents attached under this video. Today, there are more than 20 companies doing more than $1 billion in revenue and more than 100 companies making between $100 million and $1 billion per year. In total, the industry makes an astonishing $192.9 billion US dollars in sales revenue per year. That is more than the gaming and movie industry do together. How much of those almost 193 billion stays with the companies and how much is paid out to distributors? On average, companies pay between 40 to 60% of their revenue back as commissions. Let's do a crazy calculation. Let's say we choose the lower end. 40% payout of 192.9 billion equals 77.2 billion US dollars in commissions paid out every single year. You know what's even more crazy? That equals $211 million of commissions of payouts every single day. It's quite impressive, right? So you see, network marketing is a pretty large profession with some amazing numbers. But let's look at the objections, what you usually hear when you hear about network marketing. One of the most common objections we hear is only the people at the top make money. Let's have a look at that one. We just learned that 77.2 billion US dollars in commissions get paid out every single year. Currently, there are around a thousand people making a million dollars a year or more. But let's round it up to 2,000 people, just to be sure. 2,000 people times 1 million equals 2 billion. 2 billion dollars go to the people at the top. That is 2.6% of 77.2 billion. But let's assume there are around 50,000 people making six figures a year. That would make another 7.4% of the 77.2 billion. If we do the math here, we're talking about 5.7 billion US dollars that go to all six figure and above income earners. That means we still have 69.5 billion dollars left and that money goes to everyone else. 90% of all commissions go to people who work full-time but make less than six figures, people who do it as a side hustle, and to people who just want their products for free. Isn't it crazy how many lives the industry already changes every single year? Another objection we've all heard is, it cannot work as one day everybody will be involved. Okay, regarding the WFDSA, 118.4 million people are actively involved as distributors. That is way less than 0.5% of the current world population. I would say there's plenty of opportunity out there. But just as a quick reminder, nobody gets paid on bringing people into a system. You get paid only by moving products. And here we have some great news for the women. 74% of all distributors are women. Women are crushing it. And I mean, it's obvious that women are just better in relationship than men, right? Maybe it's also because more than 65% of all goods sold in direct sales are products in the wellness or cosmetics industry. Little advantage for the ladies here. Most impressively is the constant growth of the industry, even in times of recession. Just in the last four years, the industry grew from 183.6 billion to 192.9 billion. That is a 9.3 billion US dollar growth in only four years. If you want to dig further into the numbers, feel free to check out the full report I attach under this video. And as always, if you have any further questions, please let me know and I see you in the next video.